In less than a month, property taxes are due in Utah, and many Utahns will have a bigger bill to pay after dozens of municipalities voted to increase them earlier this year. That includes those who live in South Salt Lake. Their property taxes went up 67% among the highest rate increases in the state. For a home valued at $397,000, that means an almost $300 tax increase. April Baker looks into how the money will be spent and who will benefit. The Central Park Community Center is more than just a place where Christopher Romero practices his punches. It's just really cool to me like when I can hit fast and hit hard. The 17-year-old spent a lot of his childhood there. It's one of 14 locations throughout the city where Promise South Salt Lake is offered. The free program gives youth academic help, nutritious meals, and a safe place to go after school. Since Promise's launch 10 years ago, the city says it has seen a 71% decrease in the number of juvenile arrests between 3 and 6 p.m. And police officers play an important role in this program's success. But it builds a relationship of trust with our youth, right? So our, our youth come up and, and speak with us and they're not afraid to talk to us. But Police Chief Jack Carruth says his officers' level of involvement depends on whether the department has enough staff. And that has been thrown into question lately. In the past year or so, we've kind of faced a challenge in the industry um, with pay increases in the valleys. It's what led to the city's first property tax hike in 16 years, according to Mayor Cherie Wood. We needed to take some action to ensure that we uh, had the funding to stabilize our department and keep our officers here in South Salt Lake. She says the hike will help generate $3.5 million that will only go toward public safety. For the police department, it means six new hires, better pay, and ultimately more opportunities for officers to have a positive impact on youth, just like Christopher. Reporting in South Salt Lake, April Baker, Fox 13 News, Utah.